Fairly obvious get out that leg chop, but it seems to work so often and gets them out of trouble. The spread. And it looks like a fast one. Oh, yes. <laughs> the Baron suplex uh, almost there. <laughs> Certainly not an orthodox suplex, but a good one is over the top. Neatly for the cross press. He doesn't go for the cross press. The double knee. Double leg Nelson out of Bostic. Very near chance for Baron there. Bostic very neatly out. nearest thing we've had in these first four rounds to uh, score Don't go through, and he's still got the lock chance on there with a full Nelson ground position as well. Decides to go for the double oh. instead. <laughs> and Bostic's certainly getting none of his own way at all in this bout. He's the most experienced of the two, the more experienced of the two, no doubt, but. The stone is giving away, worrying on the last spent. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> trying to reach for a crutch hole there. I don't you might get it now. Whether he'll get the slam in. There it is. The follow down. Very loose and late. Far too late. And the reverse double leg Nelson to Baron. Double arm to Buster. Still with his weight between the shoulder blades when he wants it. Fifteen seconds. Oh. So, no score up to the end of round four. Sultan Bostrick talking of ambitions as you were in the last interval. To Sultan Bostic's ambition, of course, is another crack at the British title, which he held for some time. He took the title off Jim Brakes way back in the 1969 and lost it to John Cortez in the following year. And would he like another crack at that British title? He got it the first time, just after his naturalization papers came through. Seconds away, round five. Round five and two to go. Zvostrik in the light red trunks versus Robbie Barron. And one fall decides the box. One fall or one submission, and it's the first real genuine reprimand that Zvostrik has received from referee Max Ward. But the crowd here at Chelmsford really enjoying this one. 
Needs a knee, but have gone the back very quickly indeed. Double eight Nelson Bossy got a chance here, but only a count of two. Folding press now to Barron, and he might have it. He's got those arms pretty tied. He's got it. Barron just make it on the counter move with the folding press from underneath. Very neatly done indeed. And Robbie Barron, the winner over Bostic in round five. Again, ladies and gentlemen, the winner for the early four required, Robbie Barron. And the loser, please, get my hand back, y'all. All right, again, ladies and gentlemen, Robbie Barron is the winner and the loser, please. Thank you.